Welcome to my home. My name is Cyril Renaud. I am the executive chef of the Mandarin Oriental in New York City. I'm going to be doing an authentic seared salmon, which is already in my pan right here. I have a brown butter with a little bit of spring garlic right here. I have some stir fry asparagus that I've put in. I have a little bit of segments of grapefruit that we're going to be doing. This is, uh, you have grapefruit, oranges, and a little bit of lemon. I have a little bit of soy sauce. We're gonna have a little bit of mirin, the Japanese wine. And here is your salmon that's cooked in only on the skin side. So the salmon, what I did is I started this pan with a little bit of oil, not too much, because you know that the fish will run out some of his own fat. And what you do is, when it's about medium heat, you put the fish down, and then you press gently on the fish to make sure that the skin is fully attached to the bottom of the pan. You're gonna start feeling the crackling of the, of, of the of the skin, and then by doing that, you're gonna make sure that the skin stays that way. And then, obviously, you start with the medium heat, but then you reduce the heat because you don't wanna to get too high. Uh, after maybe a few minutes, you reduce the heat, and then you cover it, I cover it like this, and I cook it for about five, six, seven minutes, right? And then now we are at the point where it's almost ready to flip, and my cooking is actually done. You could use a cake tester. What you do is you press it like this here. It will tell you about and then you put it to your lips here, it will tell you the temperature of the fish inside, which right now is just wrong. So obviously it tells me that the fish is ready, and I'm about to flip it after that. So I'm going to increase the heat so it's ready for us when we finish it. And now we're going to be doing the sauce. I have a grapefruit here that I already segmented, and then you do segment of your oranges. Now, you could also do some slice if you wanted to, but uh, this way it gives you the chance to remove the seed if uh, if there is any in the food that you're going to be actually doing, right? So I would suggest to do that. It's very simple. Once you have removed the skin, you just go around like this, and you are able to do some nice, beautiful segment. And when you are at the end like this, you actually, I'm watching my fish as well at the same time, you actually press to extract the juice, right? Very important. So you want the flavor. Nevertheless, you want the segment, but you also want to have the juice. So right here, we're going to be doing also the lemon. We're going to remove that little white part here. You want to remove, and then I'm doing the same thing, right? Again, if a seed goes in there, it's okay. You're going to have the chance to remove it. It's not a problem, and you know you have enough time. So the idea is that you should have that done in advance, obviously. So when your fish is ready, you're able to plate it and flip the fish right away into the right here we go now you know very important to have the lemon right and right there so you have all this mix right here right okay what i'm going to do is i'm going to do a little bit of soy sauce right right here i'm going to add the marine and then i'm going to add the brown butter inside here yes that's the french touch with the a little bit of Japanese fish right here. So that's your sauce. What you could do is slightly warm it up, right? So the time I'm gonna flip my fish and plate it, I'm gonna be doing that. So here I'm gonna put the rice. Put this up. I have my beautiful rice. Yeah, here. Oh yes. Froggy is watching me right here. I'm doing the right thing. Right there. Right here, this is our mix of rice. Now I have my fish. What I'm gonna do, because I know my fish is ready, I don't have to, so I'm gonna flip it, right? Very quickly, just give it a gentle, and when it's ready, and then you have your beautiful fish right on top of the rice right here, right? As you can see, it's nice and crispy, right? Beautiful. I add my asparagus right on top, right there, and now I'm gonna add my warm sauce. No, I'm going to take a nice little, maybe I'll take a salad, here we go. Right there. Man, I'm adding this juices here, and it's fruity. So it's very fresh for the springtime. You have the nice asparagus, which are gorgeous right now. And then you have that nice sauce, it's right there. And then again, we're going to do a little more banana action. I have some chive and some mint that I can do right here. Again, we use that for the spring and right there. 
Here you have the Atlantic salmon with the citrus vinaigrette. You have some mixed rice and asparagus.